Multimin supplies copper, selenium, zinc and manganese in an injectable formulation which is absorbed within 8 to 10 hours and stored well in the liver for later use. It also results in increases in the actual enzymes relying on trace mineral for reproductive and immune function. Trace minerals are delivered through the umbilical cord to the unborn calf and are a direct reflection of the cow's trace mineral status. Extreme heat, drought, variable feed intake and antagonists in the feed and water can lead to trace mineral imbalances in both the cows and their calves. It is therefore crucial to have a well supplemented cow in order to have a well supplemented calf. Treating pregnant cows with multimin at preg test or around 30 days before calving is recommended. Trace minerals in calves are critical for proper functioning of the immune system and to support optimal growth rates. Due to the rapid growth rate and the fact that cow milk is a very poor source of trace minerals, calves rapidly deplete the trace minerals they were born with, often resulting in low levels at weaning. Calves may be treated with multimin at birth, marking and again at weaning or pre-sale. When administering a vaccine, it still requires cattle to mount a good immune response for which trace minerals are critical. Several studies indicated that treating cattle with multimin at the same time as vaccinating improved the immune response after vaccination. This means healthier cattle, reducing antibiotic usage and treatment costs. University studies also indicated that treating cows 30 days before joining may improve overall pregnancy rate, timed AI pregnancy and calving distribution. Treating heifers with multimin 30 days before joining when using a 14-day cedar program has also proven to be more successful than not including a multimin treatment. In a Kansas State University study, bulls were treated with multimin at weaning and again 90 days later. These study results showed that bulls with relatively low initial serum selenium were more likely to fail the bull breeding soundness examination. Multimin treatment rapidly increases the selenium status of cattle. The study also revealed that this multimin protocol increased the progressive movement of sperm cells significantly and 3% more bulls successfully passed their breeding soundness examination. This means 3% more bulls available for sale. Multimin is available at all leading rural supply and animal health stores. For more information on Multimin, please visit www.verbac.com.au forward slash Multimin cattle.